Hey guys, it's a girl they told me you are welcome back to trends. Yes, oh how are you doing wherever you are? Top of the day to you. Yes, it's another edition of trends. Yeah. Okay, now if you have not subscribed to this channel, kindly subscribe. Okay, be kind enough. Alright, yes. Um, there are still good verses here and there, you know. Some are still good, very I mean thoughtful of their employee. Okay, what we're talking about um for me the bio the actor he gifted one of his employees a car a toyota corolla as a means of appreciation so that the guy was kind of a being loyal to him and all that be good is you know it's a good one that he can appreciate your worker at this point that is, i mean the economy is not smiling for somebody to give to you a car it means a lot even though people were saying different things in the conversation, people, Nigerian people, and ah, some people, when they grab that, their keypad like this, they can just you know, they begin to type stupid things. Like, really, it's, I mean, if it's so easy for you, have you ever been gifted a car because you work so hard for somebody? It's not so easy. It's not every boss that can acknowledge an employee. And then, you know, a lot of people are so loyal to their boss, but they don't send you just, they only, at the end of the day, they give you a salary, and that is it. But some, for someone to be thoughtful as Femi and the you know, it's, it goes a long way. It's, um, it's a lot. Give to somebody a car at this time, it is a, it's a lot. It's a lot, it's a lot, it's a lot. Yes. So, it's not easy at all. If it's easy, run out too now. Okay, moving on with our stories. Yes, um, this 2022. It started with a lot of ritual killings, adoption, kidnapping, and all. Oh, God help us. Honestly speaking, one has to be careful, especially now that election is coming closer. It's um, you know, everybody just needs to be more careful. Okay, there's this report of a beautiful five-year-old girl that was just murdered, just like that, from a school. Imagine a teacher planning an adoption of his pupil. At the end of the day, he demanded for some money, and just because the little girl can recognize him, why wouldn't she recognize a teacher? And then you poisoned her to death, and you buried her in a shadow grave inside the school premises. Honestly speaking, Nigeria and, uh, I don't know, crime, crime, I don't know. Like, seriously, this is not doing good to our image outside the country, outside, and all, all these news, everything is being reported, people read stuff that are happening to Nigeria, Outside all these things, they're not good, they're not doing any good to our image at all. You can imagine a beautiful year old, a five year old girl, murdered in the cold blood, just like that. Like, seriously, this is so bad. I know some people they just they are too evil, they are too evil, evil, they wake evil, they wake everything, they don't even oh gosh, I felt for the parents of this of this girl. And according to the reports, these same teachers they were among the set of people that came to. Like, mourn with the kid, uh, with the parents of this child when they were first looking for her. You know, some people they can do a too much, they are the one behind the problem, and they are still going to be, you know, shaming by a bit to say that thing. Honestly speaking, it's not funny at all. 2022, you got to be careful. Okay, moving on with our stories. This story is kind of funny, but at the same time, it's painful for the, the the woman that is involved, you know. It is funny because, you know, men and their race, okay. According to reports, this man married his wife's maid. Simply because the wife is always busy. She is busy, always um, out of the country most times. And it is the same lady that was taking care of the household, the kids and everything. So eventually... The husband married the maid and you expect peace in that kind of family and no they cannot be peace because even if at the end of the day you want to do his because how uh, and we know how they are muslim and in the north they will claim that okay their religion allow them to marry men, men, men. <laughs> that is always their excuse okay but why would you why would it be your maid for crying out like your housemaid that she brought to the house it is so it is disrespectful on the part of the on the wife if you want if at all okay your, your religion have allow you to do it why should it be the maid 
somebody else. I mean, there cannot be peace for crying out loud. Truth be told, the woman she can it's been so difficult for her to live with a housemaid as a co-wife. It will be difficult. What are you talking about? So the woman is playing that she's not gonna take it and then she's just going to destroy everything and everything. It is understandable because it's a maid for crying out loud. You can do it outside. Why must you be the maid? Even at all, if I tell you, okay. Your religion allow you to do as many men as you want to do. You can go outside. It shouldn't be your maid. For crying out, it's so disrespectful. It is. It is. Okay, well, I'll be like bicycle. Oh, hey, God. There's a new report in town from this lady. She was like, okay, this is what happened. She saw it with her own eyes. Like, this ritualist, um, they are using different ways and method of using people. Now they are using people's hair. She said she witnessed this thing while she was at the salon. The woman was passing so much air that was already packed in the nylon. She handed the head to a man that was standing and then in return the man gave her a lot of money. I think this is the um, same thing I've heard about it one time, exactly the way this lady said it in this video. So we just need to be careful. Now it's hair. You cannot even go to the salon to make hair. You know there's no way you go to the salon, probably one way or the other, it's, you know your hair will just come off. And now that this whole thing is happening, my sister, my brother, you have to pack your hair even if you went to, you know it's so serious that different things different means of i don't even know somebody's air again like this morning they just want to make this money by all means they don't even care whichever way the money comes they just want to they are bent on destroying people's lives imagine using people's air again guys be careful out there let's watch this video wonder shall never end not the way we know go see for this our country again i beg if you come across this video try i beg me and share it because this thing what i see this morning it fear me where it shocked me shake my mind where well i go salon this morning make i go make my hair i just they enter there i can't notice the one big man there the woman there let that head the inside head the inside leather inside leather so as they see me they don't continue the conversation she just carry the bag do the one um, the Leather of hair, give the man. The man of my one a bunch of money. If you see this money, what he tell you, carry give the woman. So after I can't sit down, I can't like one tell the woman say, I swear to go do for me. Now one spirit tell me say, ah, why you know ask this woman this way? Now now say, madam, na el na the sender. Now she say no, the man they born hair. Say that they born hair. Say I be mad just forget the matter. Now say born hair, madam. Hmm. Wonder shall never end. My brother, my sister, why this thing? I carry a conscious social media this morning. Now, for me, me, you, we they watch this video. You, we they watch this video. More we'll save life, more we'll save ourselves from problem, from all this ritual. It's not where we no go see. Now, yahoo yeah, boys, no be them again. No be them they kill, they carry spare parts. No be them they and do girls again. Street girls again. Now, now, hey, they want you to get us. If you be man, you be woman. I beg, you go make your hair or you go bab your hair. I beg, gently bend down. Keep pride aside. I beg, pack your hair by yourself. May you burn your hair. This thing fear me this morning. Fear me. I tell you, say, the kind of shock where they my mind up to now. I say I won't make trouble with this woman, but the man already go. I beg, make you not share this video. More save life. I beg, anywhere where you walk, huh? go say you won't make your hair. You won't bad your hair. By yourself, carry your hair. Go house. Go burn up. If you know if you born, if you smoke, carry and put inside pits. Then they throw them inside pits. I beg, may not save life by sharing this video. May not save life by sharing this video. I beg, tell your brother, tell your sister, your sister. I don't know who and who need to know about this video, but I beg, may not be very careful. No, be only body parts that they use for ritual again. They they use hair. They they use hair. It be like say I'll go bab my own na self. Which one even they safe? Even they bab themselves. But any hair, any hair, beg me na bab na self. They born on a hair. Save life by sharing this video. Make na save life by sharing this video because this year now waiting me my eye no see my ear no hear. I no read for internet now waiting me I want to talk this year. <laughs> me na share life for. Okay, guys, that's all we have for you today on trains. One has to be careful. 2022, we have to be. It started with a lot of <clears throat> Richard killings here and there. That was, 
you know so many news about ritual killings somebody and the way that you know most of them they don't go scot free god so good god so good this is the two we have seen a lot of reports that they're always okay at the end of the day so this person was caught we're trying to you know but even though they are catching them we still they're not stopping they're not scared they're not afraid the more god will continue to expose them by god's grace just be careful guys out there okay see you around some other time bye bye for now